Good day guys. Welcome to Maths is Made Easy with teacher Satya here. In this video, I'll be teaching you guys on how to do a 90 degree rotation counterclockwise about the origin. Now make sure you watch the entire video to have a better understanding of this topic. Now let's get to it guys. Now when we talk about rotation, that mainly three main rotation, all right guys, we have a 90 degree clockwise, a 90 degree counterclockwise, and a 180 degree rotation. And in this video, I'll be teaching you guys about 90 degree rotation counterclockwise, all right guys. Now let's go ahead and solve a few questions. So what you see right here is what we call the coordinate grid or the coordinate plane, and it consists of four quadrants all right guys now let's go ahead and draw a shape first let's say i have a triangle right here right here and let's say right about here all right guys so i have point a point b and point c now first what we're going to do is we are going to write the ordered pair of each of these points so point a is three and seven all right guys so when we write the points we always start with the x-axis and going to the y-axis our point b is at 8 and 7 and point c is at 6 and 3 all right guys now when we make a 90 degree counterclockwise rotation our x y will change to negative y and x so what this means is our new x axis will be negative y and a new y axis will be x all right guys now let's go ahead and find the ordered pair for this image right here so our a prime so our x is 3 and y is 7 all right guys so first we are going to write as negative y so when our y is 7 negative y will be minus 7 and the value of x is 3 right guys now we are going to do the same thing for b prime right our y is 7 therefore negative y is negative 7 and our x is equal to 8 and c prime will be doing the same thing our y in the original picture is 3 and in the image we have negative y so negative 3 and then 6 all right guys now we are going to take this points and we are going to plot them so our a prime is a negative 7 and 3 which will be right about here so this is our a prime b prime is negative 7 and 8 which will be right about here this is our b prime and c prime is negative 3 and 6 which will be right about here c prime and if we join the dots this is what our image will look like once we do a 90 degree turn counterclockwise. All right, guys. Now let's go ahead and solve one more question. Now let's say, for example, I have a, let's say, a, an irregular quadrilateral that looks like this. All right, guys. It, it can also look like a trapezoid, I guess. Now let's say I have a b c and d so step number one we are going to write the ordered pair for each of these points so a is located at three and seven our b is located at five and nine our c is located at eight and seven and our d is located at three and three right guys now from the previous question if you remember our x y will change to minus y and x so this will be our new ordered pair so our a prime will be minus 7 and 3 our b prime will be minus 9 and 5 our c prime will be minus 7 and 8 and our d prime will be negative 3 and 3 all right guys now let us take this new points and plot it on the graph so our a prime is negative 7 and 3 which will look something here negative 7 and 3 is right here so this is our a prime negative 9 and 5 will be our b prime 
negative 7 and 8 will be our c prime and negative 3 and 3 will be our d prime and if we join the dots the image will look something like this all right guys and that is how we would rotate uh, original picture 90 degree counterclockwise about the origin now if you did enjoy this video do not forget to hit on that like button and consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any future maths videos until next time guys have a nice day